Whatever it is, it sure smells good. But the thing about pasta is you have to cook the noodles first in a pot, then add the other ingredients to bake the dish. Let's see if our contestants are up for this task. We're the pasta people! My specialty is boiling the waters. But the noodles take a nice hot swim to soften up. I get to stir, stir, stir so the noodles don't stick to the bottom. Sometimes a dollop of oil helps to that too. We must set the timer and test the noodles before I drink. We made the tomato sauce to go with pasta. Rolling tomatoes are the best for pasta sauce. I hope the judges like it. I prepare the dried spices myself. I hope you enjoy this pasta meal. We the pasta people, according to the recipe, I have followed the directions completely. Two thumbs up. The news are cooked to perfection. I give it two thumbs up. It tastes amazing. Wow, did all three of us judges actually agree on something? It's hard to go wrong with pasta. That must be an excellent pasta dish. I hope I get a taste too. This is amazing. This is the first time in the whole series that all three judges have given the team all thumbs up. Let's see if our next team holds up under pressure. It's my pleasure to introduce the Cupcake Cowboys. Yeehaw! We're the Cupcake Cowboys who come from out west. I ate the frosting. I think it's the most important part. I only use real sugar. I put on the sprinkles. The only reason we need frosting is so the sprinkles can stick. After mixing, I I bake the I bake the cupcakes to perfection. I use a specializing to to create the perfect look. Please enjoy these delicious treats that we made just for you. I give it a double thumbs up. This is the best frosting I've ever had. Can I have another one? I give it two thumbs down. I don't like this frosting. It tastes like rubber. I give it one thumb down because the dough is a little raw. And I give it one thumb up because I like the decorations. Mostly good, but a couple Pacific criticisms. Stay tuned to meet our next contestants. But first, check out this message from our sponsor at Pet Care.
Contenders. This is our 57th entry in the, in the Bake Off. We never lost once, but we never got first place either. The most important ingredient is sugar. But don't forget the baking soda, or your cupcakes will be flat. But we'll never let you know a secret ingredient. The finish, finished product is amazing. I'm sure you will love it. That is so good. I agree. Is the secret ingredient cinnamon? How did you know? Because I'm a good taster and that's why I'm a judge. It was perfectly baked. My opinion should be, you should add more sprinkles. I give it two thumbs up. It's just perfect. The taste, the looks, the smell. I give it two thumbs up. Of all the things we've picked today, this is the most perfect. I give it ten thumbs up if I could. Two thumbs up. Well, there you have it, folks. These judges say this is the most perfect entry. It's a tough contest this season, so many delicious entries. I'm glad I don't have to decide who the winner is. Next, we have an exciting entry of the Dove Stack Sugar Cookie. Here comes the crazy cookie cutters. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
love to make cookies. I got the best flour from North Dakota Blue. Our insecure ingredients are cinnamon, sugar, and sprinkles. <laughs> Friend Brittany King, we made this just for you. It sounds pretty good. I think so too. There's too much sugar in it. I'm getting a toothache. Two thumbs down. I agree. I get one thumb up and one thumb down. Mmm, good. I love a good sugar cookie. We'll be back soon with some brand new contestants. We'll be right back after this message from our official mail carrier services.
Judge Judy. I'm Judge Julie. And I'm Judge George. I don't like much. I'm very judgy. I, this pizza is the best. It has all the meats that I like. What's wrong with you? Why would you make this? This is an abomination of the culinary world. I'm ready to rate it. I give it two thumbs up. I give it one up and one down. I hate sausage. I hate pepperoni, but I like steak. I give it two thumbs down. It's just gross. Well, there I have it, folks. Quite a mixed review. Next up, we have the Bodacious Brownies. These gals do their best baking at 2 a.m. Lulu likes to start at midnight. Let's see what the Bodacious Brownies have for us. I'm Lacey. I'm Lulu. And I'm Tracy. We're, We're the Bodacious, Bodacious Brownies. First, we need four eggs, one tablespoon of milk, and two cups of flour. Then we need three-fourths a cup of cocoa, one cup of granulated sugar, and a fourth a cup of vegetable oil. Mix all together, pour in a pan, and bake for 30 minutes. My favorite part is sprinkling the M&Ms on top. I think you will like it because we worked hard to perfect this recipe. We have won 15 trophies in the local competitions in the last two years, and we hope today is our big break on the Great Big Larimore Bake Off. Enjoy our bodacious brownies. They taste even better than they look. you make such a thing? I'm allergic to cocoa. I give it two thumbs down. I give it one thumb up because I like the color of the chocolate on top. I give it one thumb down because the flavor is kind of bad. I give it two thumbs down. Uh, it's not cooked all the way and I can feel the X on with my tongue.
Welcome to another segment of the Great Bay Laramore Bake Off. I am Rose. My name is Bob. My name is Bob. We're here live with the Golden Buttercups on the Sunday Series. We've seen a lot of tough competition. And I've tasted so many delicious entries, I need to wear glass pants. <laughs> <laughs> Me too. Good thing I work out. Up next is the Sunday Stars. We're the Sunday Stars. My name is Adrian. I'm Adrian. I'm Commander Chocolate. I'm Lieutenant Fudge. We're here today to make our favorite Sunday. You must start with banana slices and vanilla ice cream. This is actually a very healthy treat because it contains calcium. And the bananas are high in potassium. Toppings include sprinkles, strawberries, caramel, pineapple, and chocolate chips. Hang on! Chocolate's my department. Technically mine, too. Don't interrupt me, Lieutenant. We must have chocolate chips, chocolate sprinkles, and chocolate syrup. And fudge! Fudge and nut sprinkles, hot fudge sauce, and cold fudge sauce. Please enjoy this delicacy. Bon appetit. I'm Jermaine the Judge. I have to taste new food. I'm Judge Jake. I like chocolate, so I'm glad to judge Chase entries. I give this two thumbs up because I like ice cream and sugar. I give it two thumbs up. I like sugar and I like everything on here. I give it two thumbs up. I like chocolate, but not the fudge. So it's two thumbs up. I think we all agree. This is excellent. Mm hmm I've heard that the Sunday stars get a five-star rating every time. I personally don't like Sundays, but it looks like it tastes okay. Next up, we have the Golden Butter Cups, and they are making magic with peanut butter and chocolate. We are the Golden Butter Cups. My name is Candid. I'm Candy, and I love sweets. I'm Alfred Jr. I raised the beans to make the peanut butter we use in our famous chocolate-covered cups. I guarantee it's the best quality possible. I'm Holly. I melt the chocolate in the pan before pouring it over the peanut butter. This butter cup includes fudge, creamy fudge, peanut butter, and chocolate chips. These butter cups are a five-star treat. This recipe is very good in my opinion. Don't forget the secret ingredient. We use heavy whipping cream and only real butter. This recipe has been perfected by our team. I hope you enjoy it. Gross. I give it two thumbs down. Peanut butter and chocolate. I give it two thumbs up because peanut butter and chocolate are really good together. I have mixed taste buds on this one. One thumb up because the appearance is good. One thumb down because the peanuts taste a bit too dry. You need to work out your roasting process.
another segment of The Great Big Larimore Bake Off! Yeah. I'm Polly, and we're here to get this rolling. Rolling pin, get it? Nice pun, Polly. My name is Bill, and I love to cover the show because I love to eat. I'm Roxy, and I just love to hear myself amplified. Our next contestants are the sugar addicts. They come from Hollywood, where the sugar is sweeter. Let's see what they're making for us today.
Blair Moore Bake Off is sponsored by Crayons of Colors. Please remember to draw responsibly. Man, those judges aren't afraid to speak their minds. Our next contestant is a team called the Breakfast Club. It smells good already, so I bet it's delicious. These folks are from North Dakota where the ingredients are fresh and the air is fresher. Let's have some breakfast with the Breakfast Club. My name is Carl. We have a huge breakfast for you today that includes pancakes, waffles, sausage, bacon, eggs, and hash browns. I make the scrambled eggs for my special cookie and hinge juice and to serve the milk and pepper. Hi, I'm Richard. I put this group together because I can never get a good enough breakfast anywhere else. Our ingredients are fried fresh and so good. I kept the tree to get my own fresh maple syrup. Here's a complete breakfast. It's enough to fill my hollow leg. I hope it fills you up too. This is so much food. It can feed a family of four and there's something from every food group. I love breakfast foods. This waffle is awesome, but the rest isn't too great. It's perfect. It tastes as good as it smells. I give it two thumbs up because the sausage is perfect and the chocolate chip waffles are my favorite. I give it two thumbs down because nothing is edible besides the waffle. I give it two thumbs up because I love them, because I love the chocolate in this waffle. I guess people really love their breakfast. And some people have really strong opinions about their breakfast. The Breakfast Club gets four thumbs up, two thumbs down. Stay tuned for this next for the next contestants after this message from Pet Lovers of America. Sugar cookies, but 
These guys don't like it. I always use my secret recipe for the frosting. And I use star sprinkles. I make a I make a lot of sugar cook sugar cookies. I use fifteen pounds of sugar every day. Try some I think you'll love it. I'm Cookie Monster. I love this job that gives me free food. Hey, it's Chelsea Cheesecake. I study advanced culinary analysis at the Cheesecake Factory. Yeehaw, I'm Tracy Chuffle. I went to Calgary Cooking University and graduated first in my class. It's a cookie, so it's two thumbs up. Doesn't matter if it has bacon or not, because it's a cookie. I, it's too salty with bacon. I can't tell what it tastes like. It's, it's nasty. I give it two thumbs up. I give it a mix of you, one thumb up and one thumb down. It's disrespectful to the pigs back home. commercial break. I love them bacon stuffed sugar cookies. My name is Bert and we're here to use our experience from the Sesame Street to promote the Great Big Lermar Bake Off. My name is Ernie and I'm glad I'm not orange anymore. I had to cut back on the carrots. My name is Abby Kadabi. I have experience in broadcasting from the sky. Our next group is from Florida where it's hot, hot, hot. They love hot stuff so hot chocolate is their thing. Please welcome the marshmallows.
floating on the top. Whipped cream, I'm never gonna stop. I milk the cows myself to get fresh Florida milk. Moo! We work hard to prepare this treat. I hope you like it. We spent lots of time perfecting this recipe. Try not to burn your tongue. I can add a shot of cold milk if you like. <laughs>
honored to be judging at the Great Big Learmore Bake Off. I'm Sally Sandwich and I love to eat food. I give this two thumbs up because I love peppermint in my hot chocolate. I give it one thumb up because I like the peppermint. I give it one thumb down because I don't like because there's too much chocolate. I give it one thumb up because I like the amount of chocolate and I give it one thumb down because I do not like marshmallows. There you have it folks, a mixed review. There's no telling who will win. The competition is stiff this season. Next up we have the Marvelous Monster Mixers. Let's see what they have for us. My name is Eddie Spaghetti. I love monster cookies because they have oatmeal and my mom thinks that they're healthy. My name is Marlon Mocha. I like M&M's but I don't like Skittles. It doesn't work to bake Skittles. They learn that from our I make a whole batch with a whole dozen eggs. I gather the eggs for my own chickens. Bok! 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 I grind my flour from the wheat I grow. Bok. It's a long process but it's worth it. I hope you like it. I give it two thumbs up because I like M&M's and cookies. I give it two thumbs down because I don't like oatmeal. I give it two thumbs up because I like M&M's and they're colorful. Yeah, the mechanical section. What about you, Cooper? It's a slow day in the spring. 
Sports Equipment Store section. Oh look, some customers. <laughs> my fishing pole broke because my fish was too big. And I got so mad because my fish is too small, so I broke my fishing pole. And I have a new one. Yeah, this is a lot of fishing mark and it's only for one dollar. Great!